Um, my name is Madison Bycroft. I'm 31 and I'm from Australia. I'm presenting um, uh, an installation that's called Dead Pan Ham. And there are some elements that um, have had a previous life and there's some elements that are new. There are drawings, a film, some sculptures, and there'll be a performance that happens um, throughout, the, throughout the period of the exhibition. The, the film is about and also not about these two female pirates who lived in the uh, 18th century, um, Mary Reed and Anne Bonny. Um, and I was interested in, in trying to sort of make a, like a portrait or an anti-portrait of them, of, of, of these kind of collections of, of images and material that maybe like orbited them without revealing their identities. So it was kind of a, I guess I'm thinking of it somehow like as a negative identity politics. And I was interested in like uh, in the trombone kind of physicality that, that could be required if you weren't able to move your hands. So instead of um, making the sound via this kind of movement, you have to sort of like move your entire body back and forth in order to produce the same sounds. Yeah, so there, there, there's also three drawings uh, called Unmoored. I think I named them. <laughs> um, uh, and they're strung up against the wall in something called a fly system, which is a sort of a theatrical apparatus for uh, displaying the, the backdrops. The way that I've been working on it is that it would sort of be uh, characterized by three, three different movements. And one is starting in, in the space where my work is and moving out of that space as a form of like positing or manifesting and it's like very, that, that sort of section is very ordered with the soundtrack of uh, the Winkies from The Wizard of Oz um, marching. I don't think like I'm inspired by one particular thing. I think there's lots of sort of things that resonate with me and sometimes nothing does, sometimes everything does. Having some moment of, of inspi inspiration and then that becoming the work. Um, a lot of the time I don't know what I'm doing and it sort of is, is, is becoming something as it's happening. For me I feel like there is an important thing to think about play and uh, in, in making sense or, or making nonsense. The minimal link of a thing in common has to be established between myself and you for example in order for us to have a connection or to, to relate or for me to em be able to empathise with you but I'm also I think I'm I'm really interested in when that thing in common is like inarticulable, like there is something in common between us but I don't quite know what it is or I can't quite say what it is and I think in my practice often that happens between the different sculptures, like this thing and this thing, they have a relationship and I feel that they need to be in the same space but I don't really know why. And I think that that's a kind of politics as well, there is something about solidarity, difference being in a space together, how do we be with, with different kinds of people 